Hi, my name is Angel Lambert. I'm on my third year at Radford University and I do undergraduate chemistry research. I study the world's natural microscopic soccer balls. These are molecules that look like soccer balls but are found naturally on Earth and in deep space. They're called fullerenes. I specifically study the fullerene C84. What is a fullerene, you may ask? A fullerene is a molecule completely made up of carbon atoms into a spherical cage resembling a soccer ball. It has 12 pentagons and a number of hexagons, and has only been a topic of study for 30 years. I study C84 and its 24 IPR isomers. What's an isomer? Isomers are molecules with the same molecular formula but different chemical structures. I study 24 IPR isomers plus two additional rule breakers at various charges and temperatures. These isomers follow a rule that say no two pentagons can touch each other. This rule is called IPR and stands for Isolated Pentagon Rule. Why am I doing this? I'm trying to find the most stable isomer of C84 through computer software that calculates energies and creates images of these isomers by quantum mechanics. What's the point of all this? A lot of people think that these rule-following isomers are the most stable ones, and this is true when the fullerene cages are empty. But when the metal is formed inside these fullerene cages, an electron transfer causes the rule breakers to be the more stable ones. How does this affect the rest of the world? Fullerenes are being explored for use as MRI contrasting agents and as part of chemotherapy treatments. This means people can live without fear of heavy metal poisoning. Since humans can't metabolize the cage, they don't have to worry about metabolizing the metal either, and everyone can be a little happier. I'd like to give a special thanks to everyone involved.